Hi, I want to welcome you to another edition of I Testify with Amy. Today we'll be sharing the testimony of a sister from Nigeria. Her name is Oyin Consola Olowu. I'll share this testimony in her words. She said, God did it. I graduated five years ago with distinction from a prestigious university, but afterwards I couldn't get a befitting job. I however kept believing God for something better. I had gone for several interviews but I seemed to fail them all and sometimes discouragement came but by his grace I pressed forward and even doubled my offering despite unpaid salaries for over three months. I also made sure to keep sowing into the kingdom. Just towards the end of the fast at the beginning of this year, I got an opportunity to write an aptitude test. I dreamt that I went for an exam and everything got scattered. Despite the lack of motivation, I went ahead to write the test and I scaled through. I moved through to the third stage and almost sought the help of man to secure the job, but God prevented that from happening. Towards the last 10 days of the fast, I made a decision to praise God for one hour every midnight. I then went further to the fourth stage of the job interview process. It was a weekday and I couldn't request for another leave of absence from my work. While speaking with my mom, she said I shouldn't worry. The day for the interview came and I resumed at my workplace first. Behold, God closed not just my office but the entire complex from morning till afternoon for my sake. That is how I was able to go for the interview. Eventually, I went through the final stage and was given the job with a multinational company. My new salary is more than double my old salary including benefits. I will also be traveling out of the country for training. All of this God did without the help of any man. To him be all the glory. So many places in the Bible talks about not trusting in the arm of flesh. Jeremiah chapter 17 verse 5 to 6 says, Thus says the Lord, Cursed is the man who trusts in man and makes flesh his strength, whose heart turns away from the Lord. He is like a shrub in the desert and shall not see any good come. He shall dwell in the parched places of the wilderness in an uninhabited salt land. The Bible says it clearly, trusting in man has no benefit, but when you trust completely in the Lord, you will get the desires of your heart. Our sister here trusted God and removed her eyes completely from man and she got results. I urge us today, do the same and you'll be testifying too of your own miracle. Don't forget, if you have a testimony to share to the glory of God, don't hide it. Send it to us in 50 to 100 word to plus 234-816224-8780. And we will feature it on I Testify with Amy on Shuzaya TV. Let the world know that our God still performs miracles. You can also send in your testimony on I Testify app, which you can download from the Google Play Store. Thank you and see you next week for another edition of I Testify with Amy. God bless you.